Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix DNS server not responding on Windows 11, 10, 8 or 7. This will be applicable for both Wi-Fi and for the Ethernet. So apply the solution that I'm going to share in this video. And if you, if you have any similar issues like Internet not responding, DNS server isn't responding, then all kind of problem will be fixed. So the first you have to click on the search box of your windows type here ncpa.cpl from the suggestion choose ncpa.cpl and here you will see all kind of internet connection adapters now choose the one where you have the problem with so let's say i have problem with the ethernet then i will click on it and from the top in menu option click on diagnose this connection and it will start detecting the problem and if there would be any problem it will let you know that how you have to troubleshoot it but if you don't find any solution then you can close it again make a right click on the connection on which you have the problem with so i have a problem with ethernet so i will make a right click on it but if you have with wi-fi then click on wi-fi right click choose properties then click on the configure tab the properties box will be up click on the advanced tab here you have to look for network address click on it then from the right hand side click on the value box and type the value zero then click on ok and your connection will now be disconnected and will be reconnected again so wait until this has been completed and once done right click on it again choose properties double click on internet protocol version 4 and here you have to choose the option use the following dns server address click on it and in the preferred and the alternate dns server address you have to use either of google or cloudflare i will be sharing the ip of both of them in the description right now i am going with cloudflare so for which it will be 1.1.1 .1 .1. And in the alternate, it will be 1.0.0.1. Then click on OK and OK again. Now, once you are done with this, right click on the adapter again. Choose Disable. Wait for a few seconds. Again, make a right click on it and choose Enable. All right. Now, once you are done, you can close it. Now, again, click on the search box, type CMD. From the suggestion choose run as administrator the black window will be coming up now here you have to type few command that you will find in the description you can copy and paste here one by one the first command will be ip config space forward slash flush dns hit enter and once done you have to type another command that will be ip config space forward slash register dns hit enter again and wait until the command has been completed and after that you have to type one more command that will be netsh winsock reset and hit enter now this command will ask you to restart the pc so finally make a restart and check back your problem will be fixed so that's all guys for today hopefully this video will help you to resolve the problem of your dns server not responding on your windows ethernet or uh, wi-fi adapters and if this worked for you guys please consider subscribing to the channel like the video and still if you have the issue then please let me know in the comment section till then take care bye bye